the primary reasons for building a containment area are really for environmental protection. Uh, reduction of soil erosion, prevention of, uh, of soil loss, nutritional management of use, particularly in late pregnancy, and to facilitate pasture growth at the break of the season. Additional uses can be finishing lambs, uh, managing weaners in between the reduction in feed quality at the end of the year and stubbles becoming available. And in some cases, containment areas can also facilitate increased carrying capacity during winter. In terms of soil erosion, there's nothing to be gained by sheep running around scratching in bare paddocks. To leave some ground cover available enhances water entrapment and pasture growth at the break of the season. And nutritional management of sheep, particularly in late pregnancy, is much better managed in a confined area. As you'll see, uh, the sheep are quite content, uh, provided their nutritional requirements are met. And that means that when it's time for the ewes to uh, start lambing and get out of the containment, that hopefully there'll be at least five centimetres of pasture growth in front of them. So in a nutshell, the advantages of containment areas are to reduce or prevent soil erosion, for nutritional management of the sheep, and to facilitate pasture growth.